Prince William is stepping out before the somber anniversary of the Grenfell Tower fire. On Friday morning, the Prince of Wales, 41, visited the Queen's Park Rangers football stadium in London to learn more about how the soccer club has supported the community since the devastating blaze. On June 14, 2017, a fire tragically tore through the 24-story Grenfell Tower apartment building in West London and killed 72 people. It was the deadliest residential fire in Great Britain since World War II, the New York Times reported. The soccer stadium is less than a mile and a half from where the tower once stood, and the Queen Park Rangers team's charitable arm, QPR in the Community Trust, has provided support to those affected ever since. Prince William met with the charity's CEO and retired soccer star Les Ferdinand to hear how the trust responded immediately after the fire, and continues to support. The Prince of Wales also spent time with community and youth workers funded by the trust, who offer mentorship, mental health support and personal development services to those affected by the fire in the local area. Prince William then connected with survivors, bereaved family members and local residents who have organized or participated in special soccer matches including Game 4 Grenfell and the recent Grenfell Memorial Cup. William heard how the tragedy affected them, how soccer has made a difference in their lives and what life looks like as the sixth anniversary of the Grenfell Tower fire approaches. Prince William has served as president of the Football Association, the governing body of English soccer, since 2005, and has previously advocated for the positive impact sports can have on mental health. Last year, the Prince of Wales attended a memorial service marking the fifth anniversary of the Grenfell Tower fire with wife Kate Middleton. The royal couple was somber through the service and laid wreaths and flowers after to honor the victims. Two days after the disaster in 2017, Prince William accompanied Queen Elizabeth on an emotional visit to meet survivors, victims' families and rescue workers affected.